So hi guys, today I am going to be doing another haul. Um, I have a lot of hauls because I have nothing else to do with my life but look online and sit on a couch right now. Um, so I'm going to show you guys what I bought. Uh, this is another Romwe haul. It came pretty really quick. I think I got it August 4th and today is August the... 14th, so it came in like 10 days, and that was just with regular shipping, uh, no of the express. Again, didn't want to pay the extra fees that come with getting things faster, so I went about it that way, but this time it came in a box rather than a bag, um, so I'm just gonna sit that on the floor and then show you guys what I got. So I am using some crazy scissors because that's all I got, and there's a lot of tape on this to open this just to kind of use the edge of it and when I did order this I requested it go to my front door but it still got sent to the mailbox so I'm not sure why so I had to hop in my car and drive down the street and it's not a huge deal except for the fact that I'm on crutches and carrying a box plus crutches is not the easiest of things to do so I kind of had to pray and hope for the best that I wasn't going to fall over. I think they might have opened it because there's blue tape on here, but maybe not. I don't know. So this time I got 30 different items, a little bit more than the last time, um, a little bit more expensive than the last time, and all of these clothes I will wear for like ever until they are dead. I'm not overly one to donate my clothes just in the sense that like I have a pair of jeans that are 10 years old and I just keep wearing and wearing and wearing them <laughs> until they get a hole and then I'll patch the hole and then wear them and wear them and wear them until literally you cannot wear them anymore. Um, that's my habit so some of these things are just so cute and they caught my eye so I grabbed them. Okay so we'll just go top to bottom because the box is like Full. like really full so we'll just yeah we'll make her through our way through <laughs> way through that okay so the first thing that I got was a bikini top it says medium I don't remember getting medium because I don't have a lot of anything to fill out a medium um, so this does look a little bit big for me just in the sense of weight, uh, the band around. My band's about a 30, so I don't wear a really big band, but this is a cute little, um, oh, has a little bit weird of a smell, but I guess the straps come out from here, and then they go through the cups and then come out the center there. That's really cool, actually. That's smart, because then if you you can notice if it's coming undone rather than be like, oh, I just lost my bathing suit top. So that's really, really cool. I will put a clip of me wearing this as well and what size that I did purchase. And again, it comes with the uh, cups in the center here. So those will probably be taken out when I go to wear it. Ah, next thing. So this one does say Romwe, so we are getting a few more bags that actually say Romwe on them. And this, ooh, that is not a good, that is not a good feeling thing at all. Like, at all. <laughs> the material on this one is a little horrendous. Um, it's a very light cotton material. Um, I'll have to look at what material this was the last time. I don't remember it being this cotton. Um, the picture makes it look like it's a polyester material so I'll take a peek on that and then insert a clip and it does come with the straps here with the little design and then you tie them up in the back and that also has the little design. So the next thing that I got was a t-shirt and these bags, the Romwe ones, feel cheaper than the Shein bags which seems odd but they do like they're just a lighter plastic than the other ones. Why plastic? I vote Rom Wee and Xi'an, you get bags that are fabric, like a cotton or a muslin, and then you can compost them or reuse them for like your groceries, and that would be such a smart idea. So we should start a petition to get them to do that. I don't know how well that'll go over, but I mean, it would be beneficial. So I got this shirt, and I guess in a size medium, and it looks like this, and it just has the sun and the moon on it, and has the saying, the, the sol, 
et le lul, I believe is how you pronounce that, but I will show you guys me wearing that. I liked this because it was just a basic t-shirt, nice and soft. And then another pair of camo pants because we can't have enough camo pants. Um, these ones are more so the material that I thought the last ones were going to be, so I'm excited for this. Okay, something I didn't notice in the picture was this, like, thing on the edge here and I have no clue what this says. At first I thought it said tonight you um, but it's T-O-N-G-T-O-Y? O-U-Y. I have no clue what <laughs> I have no clue. Um, but they are camo again. They are like a twill material. They do have a weird filling texture so I'm assuming they print on the camo part of it. They do have decent sized pockets and then the cuffs on the bottom like that. The stitching looks good. So these are very basic pants. Um, they've just done the encasing with the elastic and then they've done the serger stitch that a lot of like fast fashion clothing is made with. I prefer to sew and then serge everything just because you get that double uh, security on the item. Um, whereas I find with these sometimes, if one goes, then the other one goes, but it's kind of like that. I don't know. They're nice, but I, like, I don't know. I don't like the texture, but I like that it's a two-tone pink on one side, black on the other. And then I also got a skirt that was very similar to the pants, um, but the actual like orange color of camo. So it looks like this. Again, a weird texture on, so I'm not sure what they spray on their clothes, but there's something on their clothes. Um, and I don't know if it's to prevent like when, when they ship things, moths or bugs or animals like mice and things like that can get into the carts and on the ships and on the planes um, and then eat holes through your clothing. So I'm assuming that's why they have that texture on here, but I'm not sure. And then it also comes with a little belt that you can clasp and unclasp and it is stretchy so it should fit a variety of sizes. A single button, just a plastic one, basic zipper, KOB zipper, which is different than the zippers on a lot of clothes, which are YK something, I think. And then it also has these pockets on it on both sides, and there's no securing on it, so um, there will just be a little bit of ironing that comes into this after washing it. And then to go along with my camo stuff, I got a pink camo top. And it looks like this. It's just like a basic tank top. This is a nice feeling. So this is the material that I thought the romper was going to be made out of, but wasn't. It's supposed to be a crop top. It looks like it'll just be a crop top on me. Um, but I'll wear it with the two-tone pants, I think, and see how that fares out. Okay, the reason that I bought <laughs> this package of clothing are these pants. Uh, they say Shein on the bag for this one, so I'm excited for these. Um, these also, so I thought these were going to be uh, more of like a work pant material, but they are more of a denim, which I won't 100% complain about. It's a little unfortunate because I probably won't be able to wear them to work though, which is sad because that's why I bought them. Um, but so far they look good. They have the silver button here and it has jeans. Jeans is the brand on here. You can tell if you look, it's not a very like expensive metal. It is, um, like if you put a penny through one of those penny presses and then you could like bend it, that is what this is like. Um, just like they've used as little amount of metal as they physically can. Same thing with the zipper on this. It is not a very good zipper, um, but those are things that over time, if they break, those are simpler to fix. Uh, just kind of like seam rip up here and then reinsert a new zipper or just pop this button off and re-put in a, a new button. But overall, they're kind of, they give me a corduroy feel to them. Even though they're not, they're definitely a twill material. 
which is nice because it is more like a jean. Um, I might actually be able to get away with this because they are white and not everybody knows the difference between different fabrics. It's just the pockets where I might get a little caught up as they are um, just basic pockets as well. And I got this in a size US 4 or small, um, which hopefully should fit me. Um, and they are straight leg pant as well. And back to cherries, because why not? I got another cherry top from Ramwi, and it looks like this. The straps are short. Like, look how short those straps are. Holy crap. And then the top, I would say the material is nice. I like this material. It's soft feeling, um, stretchy enough. The stitching is good. And the cherries are just kind of they are what they are and it's a crop top again not used to wearing crop tops so we'll see how that goes another top this one's cute so this one again has that like weird feeling to it but it is just like a basic slightly oversized crop top um, not much special with it but it does have the palm trees and sunset on it and I really enjoy this color and then next I got a couple tartan uh, printed patterns as well. So I got this one here, which is just a cute little bodycon dress. Again, just that soft material, super stretchy, um, possibly a little see-through. But overall it's good. It has the adjustable straps on it, and then it has some strings and I also got a skirt in a similar print as that. It's just a lighter purple compared to the other and in a different material. And it looks like this. I think my biggest thing with them is just their variety and material type. <laughs> like if they would just be consistent with what material that they want to use for each one. Because this definitely has, like this is a polyester more so than a cotton. But it does have like a twill weaving to it so it's just kind of it's kind of a mixed material it's not a terrible filling material but it is it is what it is and then they did decently on the invisible zipper and then up at the top it kind of shows a little bit but the zipper pull covers that so let's see how this zipper works smooth on the zipper so can't complain about that and then they just use a basic lining on the inside with their darts and such so hopefully that fits well and wash as well as well. So next I have this shirt here. It's from Shein from the bag there. Has cute little sleeves, this adorable print on it. It is really lightweight, um, a little see-through, so I will have to wear a tank top or something underneath, but overall this one will definitely fare well for wearing to work. And again, because you can never have enough bathing suits, even though I've bought like 17 this year, and I won't be wearing probably any of them till next year, uh, I got this top here. This one is in a small. Okay, so I definitely more than likely bought the strawberry one in a small as well. Um, so I will check that out. But this one is just a basic purple tie-up, so we'll see how that goes. I thought about just wearing it as like a top piece, but I'm not sure terrible boob circles again I don't know why either like line the whole thing with a cushion or don't at all is my opinion on this and these you can remove again though but it does have a cute little ruffle design on the bottom and we'll make sure that lasts forever I got a pair of shorts they are checkered shorts they came in a wrong wee bag this does not quite feel like the material I thought it was going to be online. I try to look at the materials and what they call it, but they don't specify exactly what the material is. They just go polyester 64%, cotton 36%, and then they call it a day. And I'm like, okay, but like, that could be anything. So what material you using? So I got these shorts here. They're not terribly bad. Um, they're not like... The best or the material I would have used. I would have used like a more thicker cotton material to make these rather than this uh, polyester material because this comes across as more of like a pajama bottom than they do shorts but they are a cute little checkered print. Buy so much stuff I got sucked in. This also is not the material I thought it would be. 
there's a lot of, okay, so this I would have definitely thought to be a different material, um, just due to the picture again, but it has pineapples on it. It's, uh, like a girl's men's shirt, so it's supposed to mimic a guy's, and it has just a nice little collar, and it's a button-up, so we'll see how that goes. I got this dress here in hopes to be able to wear it to work, so I'm hoping that the material is nice. Okay, this material is pretty nice. Uh, just a basic, like this is any of your little polka dotted dresses are made out of. Uh, a little sheer, so I will wear like undergarments that will suit this. Basic little straps, and then it does have the invisible zipper, which they did quite a good job on this one as well. Let's see how it works. It's a little uneven, which, not to be pucker, <laughs> um, <laughs> but those are just things. So then it's just a nice smooth opening. I think I got this in a small, but I have no clue. I don't really 100% remember sizes, I just kind of buy things, but it is cute and it should be long enough to wear to work. Now from Shein, I got a cute little tank top here, which... Not 100% sure if this is going to fit me. <laughs> the breast area looks really, really big. Um, or bust area, I guess, is the technical term. This is a size small, though, I think. Medium. This is a medium. I'm not sure why I would have gotten a medium in this. I've really got to go check. But it looks like this. And if it doesn't fit me, it's going to my sister. So that'll be great. So then I got this uh, checkered print skirt here. It's very cute. It is a nice material for this. This material is what I expected for this skirt, um, whereas those shorts I didn't, but they do have pockets, a little tie up in the front, and then a waistband, and then it has this nice little hem line going on here where it's kind of curved at the bottom, which I liked because it should give you some nice shape. Okay, and then I got this dress in a extra small according to the tag. I just really like the pop kind of like word text kind of look going on here. Um, it is a little bit of see-through because it is white in that spot, but hopefully it can kind of cover. And then I got this shirt, which I didn't realize was mesh when I first bought it, and then after, before I was buying it, realized it was mesh, and then debated if I should get it because it's mesh, and then still bought it even though it's mesh. And then realized after, really, I shouldn't have bought it because it's mesh. <laughs> and I won't have anywhere really to wear it. But hopefully it'll come in handy in, like, a photo shoot or something like that. And this is also in a medium. Um, which this, I'm thankful I got in a medium because it looks like a small. <laughs> then another t-shirt. I got a lot of t-shirts and not a lot of pants. Which, I don't know why, because I have a thousand pairs of shirts. But not... No, I have a thousand t-shirts, but not a lot of pairs of pants. So that doesn't make much sense to me. So then I got this another shirt here. It says large. I'm not sure what world that's a large in. And it has some wording on the bottom that I didn't realize it had on the bottom, which could literally mean anything, and I wouldn't know. <laughs> so I hope it really doesn't mean, I don't know, can somebody tell me what that means or understand what that means would be great to tell me. Um, but it is another crop top. I don't think I realized this one was a crop top, uh, because I wouldn't have bought this many crop tops, but I guess it is a crop top, so we have a crop top. How many times can you say crop top? Crop top. Okay, and then the next thing is a set, which I'm excited for. I'm hoping I can wear this tomorrow to my brother's birthday, which we will see depending on <laughs> what it looks like. Um, and it just came with this top, another crop top. I hate crop tops. I don't hate crop tops. I'm just not a crop top person. I'm trying to expand my horizons and try to be a crop top person, but I don't think we will be a crop top person. So it's just this really basic white t-shirt with the black trimming around it um, all the way around the arms and the neckline as well. And then the reason that I got this was for these shorts here, which again, they are, this material is very light which I want 100% complain about because it gets so hot here in the summer that it's nice to have something that's super light. 
and I will probably wear my bathing suit tomorrow as well so I can wear that underneath. I honestly am like looking at this stuff and I was like, I didn't remember buying that. It was an impulse buy. I know it was an impulse buy. I don't know why I impulse bought. I shouldn't have impulse bought, but I did. So here we are and we regret. So don't impulse shop guys. But I got this cute little uh, top here with dinosaurs on it. Again, it's cropped with a uh, button up in the front as well. And that's, that is it. We got a, we got a nice scoop neck and little baby dinosaurs all over it. I love dinosaurs. I love childish things. And I know that about myself and I'm okay with that. So if you're an adult and you feel like I'm being like a 12 year old kid, that's okay. I can be a 12 year old kid all I want to. So next thing, I think this is a dress. This is a dress. This is definitely not the material I thought it would be, but it is what it is. And again, I'll have to wear something underneath, I think, but just a nice dress to wear to work again. I'm hoping it'll be long enough, um, but it's just kind of like out in the field, little country girl uh, kind of print on it, which I'm also a fan of. And it has the little ruffle hem on the bottom as well. So I'm enjoying that. The lining only goes on the skirt, which makes no sense to me. You might as well just line the whole thing. Um, but. I could probably toss the lining in there. I would just have to hand sew it all. Oh, this is not anything what I thought it would look like. But we have another dress, a wrap dress. This is not anything what I thought it would look like. This is so devastating for this one. Again, guys, like hit or miss. Um, I don't know if I looked, again, impulse buying. Don't impulse buy, and I don't know why I did that, but I did. So, it's kind of cute. I will have to wear something underneath. Again, it was intended for when I eventually return to work. Um, but it looks like the material on the bottom's not so bad. It just wish it was, like, not as see-through. It was a little bit thicker of a material. Okay, we're getting to the bottom here, guys. So, I got another shirt. Because it reminded me of, like kind of the 90s-ish, but I got this cute little fruit and looks like, I don't know if that's a radish or if that's supposed to be a beet or if there's a fruit I am unaware of that looks like that, but cute little thing with bananas and watermelons on it, so I like that. Another dress. Okay, so this one's actually close to what was on the picture. I think I'm going to take off these arms because I don't like these arms. <laughs> I just... I don't, you know, like your ability to move around is just so limited by these things sometimes, so, but it is just really nice, and it's purple, gray color, but it's cute, and that's, that's pretty much, that, that's on that. Now some pants. Okay, these are kind of like a linen, I don't know why I'm talking like this, these are kind of like a linen material. Which again, not quite the material I thought it was going to be, but it is what it is. And it looks like that. And it looks like that. And it looks like... Let's see if the button does up on this one. Oop, it does. Okay. On my other pair of pants, the button doesn't do up. Because they did the buttonhole too small. But this one looks over overall good. It doesn't look like it's going to be super see-through, which is nice. So, there's those. Oh, that's cute. Okay, so this material here is nice. And they've actually, this is all, this is all I ask, where you, like, back it with the same fabric, and that will immensely help with the see-through ability on things. But the straps don't have any adjustability, so it is what it is for the straps. And then it just has this little button up all the way down. I don't know if those are faux or real, so let's find out. Real button up, which is a lot better than the fake stuff. So that there is the dress, and then it has the same little gathered bottom tier here on the end of it, and hopefully this I can also wear to work with like a little cardigan over it. And the last thing, we got a lot more Romley bags this time than Shein, and it looks like the Shein stuff, which seems really odd, I think Romley is a little less than Shein so it's a little less quality from what I'm finding on stuff, at least like material wise, I'm finding the Shein stuff to be a better material overall. 
And then, oh look, we actually get a t-shirt with t-shirt material, rather than, okay, which they had to with this, because they cannot dye polyester. You can, but there's a different process, and it's a different dye, and I think it costs a little bit more to do. Um, but this one is a tie-dyed, I could have done this myself, but it was like $4, I think, so I was like, you know, I'm gonna buy that. Um, so, <laughs> just this little tie-dyed t-shirt. Um, and it's nice. I like it. It reminds me of clouds and cotton candy, so I got it. But that is everything that I bought. I hope you enjoyed this haul. I rather liked my other haul better than this one, to be honest with you, just like the materials and the quality of stuff um, and what I got. But um, yeah, if there's anywhere else you guys would like me to review, I hope to do some thrifting once I am back on two feet and doing some more fun videos once I'm back on two feet, uh, which hopefully shouldn't be much longer here. Uh, it was officially a year on the 13th, today's 14th so yesterday it was officially a year so hopefully not much longer um but yeah thank you for watching and have a great rest of your day bye guys